It's time for math. <laughs> so just like we do every day before we start our math lesson, uh, we're going to have our mental math. So we're going to do some quick look cards today. Okay, so I'm going to give you a quick look at the card one time. You're going to look at it a second time when I show you, and then I'll give you some time to think about how many dots you think you saw, and then we'll share some of the strategies that we came up with. All right, here we go. First quick look card. Uh, okay, let's try it again. Okay, so how many dots did you see in that quick look card? Okay. If you said 11, you are correct. Okay. Um, one of our strategies that maybe you did is you just did 5 plus 5 plus 1, which gives you 11. Uh, you may have moved these five over to this space, and then you saw you had one left, and you know that 10 plus 1 makes 11. Some of you may have even looked at the empty boxes and seen that you had nine empty boxes, and you knew that would be 11. So lots of different ways to come up with the same answer. All right, quick look card number two. Quick look. <laughs> All right, here it is again. All right, so how many dots were in that quick look card? All right, so if you said 11, <laughs> you are correct. And there's also 11 in this quick look card. Um, maybe your strategy was to take the four that are down here and you move them up here to make 10, and then you had the one left over over here. Or maybe you thought of your double facts, six plus six makes 12, take away one from the one missing box and you got 12 uh, minus one to give you 11. All right, last quick look card. Okay, right. one more look. All right, so how many dots were in that quick look card? If you said 13, you are correct. And perhaps you saw these two here and you move them over here to make a full 10. And then you had your three left over. 10 plus three makes 13. You may have also done uh, eight plus four, which you know makes 12. One more makes 13. Or you saw that there were seven empty boxes and you made your 13 that way. So... We know that math is not a one-way street, and there's lots of different ways to come up with our answers. All right, so now you're all warmed up for your math today. Remember in your packet, you have lots of different math games that you can play, uh, lots of the games we have played together. Uh, next week, I'm going to try and come up with some different math activities for you to do that are more... Uh, focus on what we've been doing in class. Um, but for now, we're just going to stick to what they have in the packet until we all kind of get used to um, doing school at home like this. <laughs> so, all right, I will catch you guys again later. Bye.